All right, and now... I told you it wasn't a good idea to go there, dude. Since your son hadn't helped us out, we'd be... I'm never going there again. If you equip gloves when you fight with your fist, your attack speed will increase. So even a shadow finds it first, you can still get the first strike. But even though your speed is fast, your range will be short, so be careful. I can never get Akihiko's voice right. This is gonna be the biggest struggle of my life. That guy looked kinda scary, but he was actually really nice, don't you think? Yeah, I agree. But I wonder what such a nice guy was doing in such a place like that. You right, you right. Um... Honestly... Let's go, let's go upstairs, because I... We got one more day. Ooh! I'm stupid! What am I doing? I gotta stock up! What? Uh, let's go to pharmacy first. Okay, I think everything else, like, we have... Uh, a lot of... Uh, weapons so far. I think we have the highest grade weapons at the, this point, to be honest. Um, let's sell first. Um, do we have anything that, like, we don't need? It might be valuable. Okay. So that. I have. Oh, I have two. So let's only get rid of two for now. This rage. Let's get two more of those. Just in case. You see, I feel like they're giving me all this stuff because, like, uh, what's it called? They're gonna be like, uh, the next big bad is gonna be like a charming kind of villain or something. Oh, I have. Oh, I have. Let's get three more. Eh, it doesn't matter. Uh, I'll sleep earlier, so I can be in great condition. You recall the story you heard at the outskirts of the station. I decided to ask the teacher about the missing girl, Fuka Yamagishi, today. Alright, say less. We finally get to see Fuka, bro. Why are you shaking like that? That's scary. I don't like this music either. Oh, Mitsuru-senpai. Why are you here? Same reason as you. Mr. Ikoda, I'm here to ask you about a student named Fuka Yamagishi. No! Uh-oh. I, I never thought it'd turn out like this. What you talking about? Fuka. Wait, you're that girl. What did you do to Yamagishi? Hold on, Mitsuru. This isn't an interrogation. I think it should be. Matsuki, you don't have to say anything if you don't want to. Hold up a second, bro. This girl has been missing for about a week, and you're saying where we shouldn't interrogate her and, like, ask her some questions? Bro, she's been bullied for the past, like, who knows how long. And this girl is the prime suspect. And she's even saying stuff that leads to her being the prime suspect of bullying Fuka and possibly even get ri getting rid of her. Why aren't we capitalizing on this? Why are you saying, bro? Schools are so toxic, bro. Like, even the teachers, like, they just trying to save their own skin. You wouldn't want to give her the wrong idea. Fuka, she... She always looked so frazzled whenever I gave her a hard time. Well, yeah. And then, I realized, she's an honor student, but deep inside, she's just the same as us. I knew exactly mm -hmm. which buttons to push. Wow. We were just messing with her that day, too. Oh my gosh. May 29th. So annoying. We took Fuka to the gym and locked the door from the outside. What? <gasps> Bro! That means she was in there when midnight struck, dude. Fuka was 
Oh my gosh, she was locked in Tartarus this whole time? What? You locked her in? That night, Maki returned to school alone. She was afraid we'd get in trouble if Buka committed suicide. Oh, that's so sick. But she never came back. And the next morning... She was found lying on the ground by the gate. I went to the gym to let Fuka out, but the door was still locked. So I opened it and went inside, but she wasn't there. We all freaked out. Starting that night, we went out looking for her. But every night, another one of us went missing, and they each ended up like Maki. I see. By the way, Mr. Ikoda, all this time, you've attributed Yamagishi's absences to illness. Wow. Oh, wow. I can't believe you've done this. But in reality, she was missing. You must have been aware of that. What was your intention? Saving your own skin. I was thinking of the students, of course. Clearly not, since you're not thinking about Fuka. You children may not understand. But we have to consider the future of everyone affected. One of your students could be dead, and you're not worrying about her? You mean you chose not to report this to the police for the good of the class? That's so ridiculous. It, it was in her best interest. I wouldn't want her records to be stained by something like this. Her parents agree. That's... So, to protect your career, you ignored your responsibility as a teacher. Thank you, Mitsuru. How despicable. Get him. <sighs> look at this man. He can't even look her in the face. Some teacher you I, are. I, I, I didn't. I, I, I was just... Uh... About your friends. Did you notice anything unusual before the incidents? Anything at all? <laughs> They all heard a voice. Oh, that one voice. A creepy voice. Uh, that talked to that one girl when Yukari was walking by. Right before each of them went missing. They said it was calling their name. Oh, man. Yeah, this is... <laughs> I'm on Junpei's wave right now. That's kind of creepy. Oh, senpai. Could it be? It's them. No doubt about it. Yep. Until now, there was no way of knowing how or why some people are conscious during the dark hour. But it's the voice. It draws them in. It's not a random phenomenon. This whole thing has made me realize they're clearly targeting humans. Shadows are the enemy of mankind. Wow. Stay at our dorm tonight. It's the safest place. If you hear the voice, tell us immediately. And don't leave the room, no matter what. If you can do that much, you should be okay. Don't worry. Yamagishi should be alright as well. Let's hope so. I'm praying for her. We'll meet after school in the student council room to discuss tonight's operation. T tonight Yes, it's a full moon, dude. We're going to rescue Yamagishi. Thank you. If my guess is right, she's still inside the school. Mm-hmm. <sighs> oh, gosh. Bro. Oh. All set. Tonight, we will infiltrate the campus. Our objective is to rescue Fuka Yamagishi. Um, I don't get it. Is Fuka inside the school somewhere? Junpei, were you not listening to the story? She was locked in the gym closet, bro. And why at night? At midnight, this place turns into... Exactly. That's how Yamagishi wandered into Tartarus. Mm-hmm. Then, ever since Fuka got locked in the gym, she's been stuck there? Exactly. That's so sick. But that was 10 days ago. Bro, she's been... Yo, I can't even handle one day in Tartarus, bro. I get too tired and I need to go home. She handled 10 days? Yo, Fuka joined the team. You better take Junpei's spot ASAP. 
that means... Not necessarily. We can't jump to conclusions. Thank you for the optimism. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour. So what about the rest of the day? Wow, I never thought about that. Now that you mention it... This is only a theory, but I think time may function differently with respect to Tartarus. So, even though it's been ten days for us, perhaps only ten hours have passed for her. Ooh. It's possible she's still alive. Wow, you think so? Uh, but the dark hour is pretty brutal. Extremely. We could barely handle an hour. How's she gonna last ten? I guess she just built different. That's true. And even if she's still alive, we might not be able to get to her. Are you just gonna let her die then? Yo, let's go, Akihiko. Man is speaking facts. I have an idea. There you go. Let's try to enter Tartarus exactly how Fuka did. Yes, yes. We'll go to the gym and wait for midnight. That's the quickest way. Yes. Is Don't that sweat. really gonna work? Honestly, I have reservations. If something goes wrong, you could all end up lost in Tartarus too. Bro, it'll be worth it. I gotta get Fuka out. But... I won't stand by and do nothing if there's a chance we can save her. Yes, sir. I'd never forgive myself. Oh, dark. If you guys don't wanna go, then I'll go by myself. Nah, count me in. Senpai? Why you turn like that, though? All right. We're aware of the risks, but we can't just leave her there. He turned away knowing everyone was gonna be like, Oh, come on, man. Fine. I agree. And we won't know until we try. Cool. We get to sneak into the school. Bro. Who cares? <laughs> In that case, I know just what to do. Please elaborate. I'm so lost. Uh-oh, I don't like the sound of that. Bunkichi and Mitsuku seem uneasy. Oh, right, Sean. We were just talking about you. I'm sorry for troubling you about the persimmon tree. I'll root out the truth. Good one, right, Sean. It's really nice having you around. I can make stupid puns whenever I feel like it. Bukichi seems happy, alright. But what about Mitsuko? That persimmon tree is a reminder of our son. Before his death, he is a teacher at Gekko Khan High School. He planted that tree on graduation day with the students in his first class. That tree is about to bear food. fruit. <laughs> Why now? Why do they want to cut it down now? Ah. Don't worry. Thank you, Raichan. That makes me feel a lot better. It's very comforting talking to you. Mitsuko seems very appreciative of your support. There you go, I'm nice. Wow, well, Raichan, you've really captured her heart. You must be popular with, with the ladies. My wife's no sucker after all. I mean... I do be out here like that, you know what I'm saying? Ah. I feel like I'm looking at myself when I was in my prime. Calm down there, buddy. I, looking at you now, I don't think I look any, I don't think you look anything like me back in the day. And I'm not talking about myself, because really there's clear it. differences there. But even uh, Rai right now, like that's, a, I don't know, you're kind of uh, overstepping. Seems being Peachy and Mitsuko have grown to trust you. Relationship is stronger now. There you go. It's getting dark out. Eee. Here it comes. Don't worry too much about the tree. Just stop by when you get the chance. Oh, and take this. It's left over. But it's still good. Crab bre Crab bread? Mm. Yo, stuff it into my pocket. You know, you realize that old people always be doing that, though? Like, they're just like... No, 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 take this, take this, and just, like, shove it in your pocket. 
and just like, no, I'm, I won't take no for an answer. Now it's time for the full moon. Time for uh, the boss. I'm kind of scared. I don't know what's gonna happen. Okay, meeting time. What's wrong? I can't get a hold of the chairman. Nah, cause he's fishy. He's doing his own plotting right I now. I guess we can handle it ourselves. There's one problem though. Without the chairman's help, I'm not sure how we can get inside the school. Oh, that makes sense. No need to worry. I've got it all set to go. This does not feel good. Set to go. An explosive? What? <laughs> Mitsuru. Come on, I know you don't know the social norms, but I we're not talking about bombs right now, like I know this is a high school, but we in Japan instead in America. <laughs> All right, I'll let you handle this. Oh, was she making a joke? Mitsuru got that sense of humor, I see. We don't have time to waste. Let's go. Akihiko seems really adamant about saving Fuka. An explosive? For real? Nah, you're lying, right? Nah. All I did was unlock a door. Wow. Junpei Loki a genius. I ain't gonna hold you. See, we got in no problem. Man, I'm a genius. I suppose. Is that really something to brag about? Never. So you unlocked it earlier. Yeah. What? No time for compliments. Let's go. Wait for us. What's the big deal anyway? Trey Ben, what's <laughs> that mean? Yo, literally, I'm like, excuse me. I I guess it's like French for like good job or something. Like congratulations. That's not English, is it? No. No, we're gonna get caught. Wait, is there anyone here? I mean, a school like this definitely deserves night guards, so I don't know, but either way, I like it dark. Oh, you scared? Oh. No! Stupid. <laughs> Why does that always make me laugh? My chest is. Quiet. It's better if we leave them off. They cut the power at night anyway. Oh. I don't like sneaking around. First, we have to find the key to the gym. Akihiko and I will check the janitor's room. You three check the faculty office. After that, we'll meet in the main hallway. Got it? The faculty office, huh? You ain't gonna be stealing no test answers, bro. Maybe we'll find some test questions. <laughs> Scum. Maybe I should go to the faculty office too. It sounds interesting. Okay, he go. I mean, he kind of a meathead too, right? Are you planning something unscrupulous under my supervision? <laughs> if so, then expect to be severely punished. It was a joke. I'd never do something like that. <laughs> Come on, Mitsuru. Line up a little. I know that Akihiko might not, but Junpei 100% would have. Fine. Let's head over to the janitor's room. Iori, you're coming with us. Ah! Hey! That means... Let's get this over with. Why? Don't you want to just like, you know, chill for a little bit? You know, I, I, I brought snacks, some candles. 
drinks. Yukari, let's get to know each other a little bit more. Your social link's taking a while to get to, so... Thought we could just, uh, hash it out now and... See where it goes. No? Okay. Oh! Oh, it's way too quiet. I don't like this at all. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, where am, where am I going again? What? Do you hear that? Oh! Th there's someone else here? Just stick close to me. They do have night guards! Unless that's some weird shadow with a light. I mean, in Persona 4, they did have that one uh, shadow, the one that the cop. So I wouldn't be surprised if there's a shadow with flashlights out here. And donuts, too. Bro, that. He, he needs to lay off. He was gonna. Mm. No. No. It's so dark. I can barely read these. I brought a candle. What does it say on this one? <laughs> Let me stop, Jim. Really? Let me see. Yeah, this is it. Mind if we borrow this? Are you asking me? Okay, let's go. We're supposed to meet them in the main hallway. So I was like, are you talking to me? Because, like, I don't look like a gym teacher or anything. Did you find the key? Sure did. <laughs> it looked like... You no. Know, I heard a scream that sounded kind of familiar. It looked like she dropped the key on the ground. <laughs> you actually did? I was just kidding. You want to make something of it? Uh-oh. Keep it down. No. We'll divide into teams again. Three of you will enter Tartarus, and one of you will remain outside with me. Once the dark hour has begun, I'll determine Yamagishi's position. I'll go. You should come too. You can take the lead like always. Um, then I'll be the third. Wait a second. Remember how I accidentally screwed up on the monorail? No, no, no. Give me a chance to make up for that. No, no, no. Oh, come on. It's not always about you. Besides, you didn't accidentally screw up. All right, Junpei. We'll give you another shot. What? Sweet. Thanks. I mean, either way, there's got to be What's wrong, four Yukari? of us, right? You don't want to stay behind with Mitsuru? Uh-oh. Ooh, because they got low-key beef. Um, no, it's fine. <laughs> it's almost time. She was looking like... Okay. I want to learn what's going on between those two. Hi. I'm all alone after all. Yes, yeah, you should be. Yikes. 
Fuka. Oh, that is creepy. Oh, no. Um. Yeah. We still haven't heard back from them. The transceiver sensitivity is set to high, too. Oh, yeah. That girl, Natsuki. I hope she's okay at the dorm. <laughs> Trying to make small talk. Unfortunately, no place is completely safe in the dark hour. But we couldn't possibly bring her here, and one of us staying behind was out of the question. Yeah, I guess so. <clears throat> I never saved. I'm so screwed. But we're all here for Fuka's sake. This is Mitsuru. I've confirmed your position. You're higher up than I expected. You're barely in communication range. Is everyone all right? Yikes. Akihiko. That's Come just in, great. Akihiko. Is he out of range? I'm starting to get worried. <laughs> All right. Can you open your eyes. Mine feels fuzzy. I wonder where you are. Are you awake? Oh, gosh. This is the first time we've spoken outside of your room. <laughs> Can we... I was about to say keep it that way, but like... No, actually, we can meet outside here. Just don't be on my bed like last time. Like, you're always like... You always end up just sitting on my bed and I hate that. Like, just... That's an invasion of privacy and whatnot. You just like phasing in and out of everywhere. <sighs> no, I hate it. Just stay here. Actually, can you can you stay here? Can we like make you just stay here? Like a permanent resident or something? Because I can't stand you. Where are the others? Yes. Don't worry. You'll see them soon. You didn't answer my question. But we don't have much time to talk. Tonight, there is more than one ordeal you must face. You should hurry. She's waiting for you. Fuka. You guys will need her. Okay, then. I hope we can speak again. No, I don't. Sayonara. All right, um... Fuka, Fuka, Fuka. <laughs> Why do I look like this? Communication is breaking up. I, you, I, this, two, fuck, can't, bruh, bet, eh. You got, so, uh, Communication has been lost. I mean, yeah. Ah, I'm trying to avoid it. Oh Confrontation, but it seems that's not really an option. Okay. Right, let's see if I can Ooh, chest, chest, chest. Gimme that. Thank you. Um Are you really about to make me go in a circle? That's crazy. Can you make sure she's breaking up? Akiko and aren't this floor. Who's there? Are you human? Fuka? Communication has been lost. Whoa, was she talking to me like that? Through my Whoa, that's sick. Don't turn around. Oh gosh. Uh, I really don't want to mess with it. Oh, another chest. Give me that. Ah. Nice. 
Nice, nice. Wait. Um. Do I go up? I don't know. Well, there's stairs, so I'm just gonna take them. I don't. Know. Communication is breaking up. What's it? Current. Look. Reply me. I. Where am I? Why am I here? Please answer me. Communication has been lost. Oh. Fuka, fuka, fuka. I'm coming. Don't worry, I got you. I'm so, like, scared for her, though. Like. I mean, I can only imagine, like, being stuck in here all this time. Can you hear me? Please answer. Is someone there? Please answer me. It's too bad you're talking to protagonist, bro. Like, anyone else would be screaming right now. Chest. As you can see, I'm really trying to take the passive route today. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Why did that scare me so much? Um... Hey, here he is. Man, we were worried about you. Sl not really like, I was about to say likewise, but not really anymore. I don't think we should enter Tartarus this way again. This is a guy whose whole idea was to come in Tartarus this way. Oh yeah, did you hear a voice while you were in here? Fuka! Uh, kinda like... Who is this? Are you human? Fuka. That's it! That's the voice! Where is she? It sounded like it came from behind us. Oh! Are you oh. Fuka Yamagishi? Oh! Wow, you're alive. That's awesome. Yes, sir. Never fear, June pays here. No, sir. I'm glad you're okay. Come with us. Thank you so much. I <laughs> That didn't sound like a proper reaction. She looks cute. Looks like we made the right decision. I'll see if I can contact Mitsuru. But for real, this poor girl. Where are we? I was at school, and then... Well, it's a long story. I'll explain after we get out of here. For literally 10 days in here. Well, 10 hours for her, technically. But that's... Oof. That's gotta be hell. Mitsuru, can you hear me? <laughs> No good. All I hear is static. Oh yeah, are, are you hurt? Have you uh, run into any monsters? So there only are strange creatures in here then. You haven't ran into any of them? I've managed to avoid them so far. Why are you talking like that? Are you serious? How's that possible? Um... It's hard to describe, but I can sort of tell where they are. Navigator! What do you mean? Are you psychic? Was this technically... Was Fuka, like, technically the first navigator of, like, a Persona series? I, I, I don't know if there was one in one or two. I've only watched playthroughs, but I don't remember. I think it was just more so, like, whole party, like, fights and whatnot. No one really is a navigator, but, like, was there? Was it Maya? No, it wasn't Maya, because she... No. Either way, it seems like she's the first inaugural navigator. She has the same power as Mitsuru. Maybe even stronger. Probably. Since Mitsuru's persona is more battle-oriented. Hang on to this. Oh! <gasps> but... But this is... A gun! Think of it as a lucky charm. It's not really a gun. All right, let's get out of here. Well, that was interesting. 
to say the least. Whoa, check out the moon. That visual looks amazing. I've never seen it so bright. Fuga actually looks cute. I'm not gonna lie. Some research indicates that the shadows are affected by the faces of the moon. Of course, the same can be said for humans. Oh yeah, full moons always be having people act up. That would explain Yucatan's mood swings. I think that's called a period. Hey, wasn't it a full moon the night we went to the monorail? Yes. Was it? Hence why we're... I think so. Why? Hey, did you see the moon on the night the dorm was attacked back in April? Full moon. Mitsuru, are you there? Oh gosh. Hey, can you hear me? Mitsuru, come in. Be careful. Mitsuru? Mitsuru! What is this thing? Uh-oh. It's much bigger than the others. And it's attacking someone. Oh. Damn it. What's going on? It's one of them. If my guess is right, they come every full moon. We have to hurry. All right, let's go. Bro. <laughs> hey, hey, wait for me. No, you can stay. You ain't gonna be any help anyway. Nah, I'm kidding. Junpei is actually a huge help sometimes. Bro, I'm really about to die. I didn't save for so long. Yukari! What in the world? Oh, the, the... There's two of them. For the real ones who have watched the previous playthroughs, the last, the, the priestess, um, <laughs> the priestess boss fight, how many times did it take me to fight her? It took three, and I didn't save very much there, so I had to go back and do a lot. So, there are, there, there's two of these people right now. Let's get it over with. Mitsuru! <gasps> uh, Let uh, uh. Hold up. Why does it look like I'm... Bro, I swear I'm not in this bad shape, like... <laughs> oh! <laughs> What's going on? Nothing's working! What you talking about? Oh gosh, now it knows we're here. Oh shit, they look pissed! Extremely. If I'm correct... What hey, the? Isn't that... Why the hell is Bro, she look. here? F Fuka. More Yamasan. Wait, what are you doing? Please get out of here. It's dangerous. Girl, if you don't slap this She's the reason why you're here in the first place. What in the world? Do not feel any pity. I would have beat the brakes off this woman. 
the moment I saw her. I don't even care if she's like charmed or like in some kind of trance. Nah, that's that's even better. Then she can't fight back. I'm a beat her to a bloody pulp. I swear. Mm -mm. I I wanted to tell you I'm sorry. Those kind of big though. I'm not... Wait, that's not a weapon. I know. Oh. Fuka just showed how much cooler she is than basically 90% of this team. Like, I, I promise, like, Junpei was not quick enough to do that. Yukari was not quick enough. Uh, Yukari took, a, like, 15 minutes to actually, like, hold her gun to her face. Akihiko can, and Mitsuru can as well. But, like, bro, she, she literally took no hesitation whatsoever. She was like, sure. Bro, go ahead. I'm all right. Be careful. Normal attacks won't work on these shadows. And all of our instruments have been destroyed. I can see that. Just stay still. Besides... I can see. <laughs> Is that the voice? I... I can sense, sense these monsters' weaknesses, weaknesses somehow. somehow. Thank you. Thank you so much. Are you gonna take- Please don't tell me you're gonna take like five turns to figure out their weaknesses. Because Mitsuru- I love her, but, but like- bur She takes forever. Please tell me you're gonna be quicker. If you do, like- I, I'll give you my life saving- No, never mind. Sir, sorry about that. No. I'll give you like a, a potion, a medicine or something. For real? Just as I thought. Mitsuru, let her take your place. I get it now. Yamagishi, can you assist the others? It's so calm about this. Best. There you go! She has some spunk in her. Stay back, Mitsuru. We'll take care of this. Please don't die. Only three of us? Oh no, that's a bit. Find out the enemy's weakness. Just let me know when. Okay. Uh, how about now? Okay, just give me some time. That's fine. That's fine. I don't mind. Um. So no, I should have. Since, uh, let me do Lilim. No, 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 no. Wait, what is, she has a... Uh, Rakunda, Rakunda, But Ara has... Everything that I would... Well, Nigi, I don't have Nigi anymore. Bro, I'm stupid, I could have had Tarunda. Okay, either way, Lilim seems like a safe bet. Let me just, uh... Okay, cool. Leave. Why her? Never mind. Go ahead, Jufei. I don't mind. And now she's back up. Alright, uh... 
Bro, are we even... I... Y'all could've told me we were gonna be... Oh. It has multiple weaknesses. Oh, say less. I I didn't know I had this kind of power. Oh. <laughs> Bro, that was a bit unnecessary. Uh, let me. Yeah, cause these guys are going ham on her already. So. Yo, this is. But oh, wait, we were fo we were so focused on that other one, and now you want to focus all the attention, bro? What is up with y'all? Y'all acting kind of different. I'm actually confused. Paradigm shift. Robert. The enemy has changed. Meaning. What exactly? Okay, just give me some time. Huh? Wait, wait. Uh. All right. Well, first off, let's uh. Well, you're y'all are both kind of. Let me get you as well, so we can just end this. Yo, guys, stop! <laughs> Y'all don't under- I'm done. Okay, there we go. Nope! Oh, gosh. Now I- I'ma have to use it. and hit her. Wait, what? Oh, he picked the fist. Oh, I... Bro, I... Now I'm, like, lost on this whole thing. Please stop. Oh, nice! Okay, I get it now. Um... So now you're gonna be... Weak to this, right? Hit him with it. What? What? <laughs> oh, I'm stupid. Electricity doesn't seem to work on it. Wait, what? Oh, we're dead. No! I get it. Alright, I'll be right back. Great. The enemy has changed. How am I doing worse this time? Please don't hit him. Oh, oh, never mind. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him again. All right, Junpei. That enemy seems to be getting weaker. Oh my god. Yep, you did. That's crazy. Oh. Okay, okay. Um. So you're weak to that, and. So let me. Oh gosh. I'm probably gonna die anyway, so let me just. Get you with that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. No. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, okay. Well, 
No, because... Ah. I might as well just say GG, because this is just... This is despicable. I can see that. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Um... Sure. And we're dead. That's crazy. This is the final straw. If I lose this time, I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I swear. I'll try and find out the end. Yeah, okay. Thanks. I already know. But like. Okay, just give me some time. Thanks. Uh -huh. Is there one that's like Oh the protection, but I wanna Yeah, I wanna Actually, no, let me, mm, no, <laughs> let me get this over with already, because I'm not, no, we're not doing it, I'm sick of it, I'm sick of it, for real, thank you, that's your chance, go, alright, Sonic Punch, Sonic Y'all can't do the Yeah, do the same move every single time. It has multiple Thanks, I, I didn't know I had this kind of power. Thank you. Thank you. Alright. Oh yeah, one of Uh, I'm tearing up. Oh my gosh. I must be sad because I'm about to win. No, stop. Oh, that was about to be so good. Okay. Um, get her. Please get her out of here. Because I swear if y'all don't go for her this time. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> the only thing that could make this perfect is if they don't do a par paradigm shift before, uh... Yes, thank you! You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're, done. You're dog water. You're trash. You're garbage. Why aren't you dead? There you go. Goodbye. 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 Where you belong. Alright, let's get this over with. Yep, I am. That's cool, that's cool. I had him with this. Now go for it. Please, just end him. End his existence. Please don't. <laughs> Strikes are useless against it. Did he attack me again? He did, didn't he? Well. Oh, wait. I think they okay, we have to look at that before. Um, B chain. Thank you. Thank you for being smart. Uh, no. Because it worries me that um, I'm wondering, like, weaknesses. if we do an all-out attack, would he uh, be like, uh, what's it called? Nah, that doesn't affect me or something, you know? No, wait a little bit longer. Thank you. Slash. I don't care if you kill him. Um, let me change 
this one to like. Who's my strongest? Uh, unicorn? Do you have anything? No. My strongest is unicorn? Definitely. Alright, come on. I'm gonna test it out this one time, because I'm certain that we can win either way. Probably gonna be like minuscule. Never mind. There you go. Come on. Do it again. <laughs> Yo, don't let this man breathe. <laughs> Fight back. Fight back. Alright, one more. End it. End it, Akihiko. You've been waiting for this your whole life. You see, it's it's moments like these that I'm just like, like every time I like fight and I do so well, after like my fourth death, I'm just like, why was that so easy? It doesn't make any sense why it was so easy. Like literally like that took, so like I finished that faster than how long I lasted my first round. That sounded so weird, but you know what I mean, right? Like, it's just like, why was it so easy? Are there more of them? No, nah, we're safe. Why she, she post up like she ready to, oh, okay. Don't worry, it's over. Nice. Fuka, you? Yeah, she's amazing. 20 times better than you. Uh, are you alright? Why are you so concerned about her? Yeah. Thank goodness. What? Yo, Fuka's better than me, because I would have. Mm, no. Oh. oh. Fuka? It's alright. She's just exhausted. As she should be. She did most of the. Well, not really. I did most of the work, as always. But she did a lot of work today. Fuka? Fuka, I... It's crocodile tears. I mean, they're obviously not, but like, it, it just upsets me. Where did these two shadows come from? From somewhere outside of Tartarus, just like before. Oh, okay. I see. Um, what are we gonna do about Natsuki? She saw the Dark Hour and the shadows. Men in Black. Don't worry, she's not like us, so she won't remember any of it. Wait, so if you walk into the dark hour, and you don't have a persona, like, you'll forget everything that happened? Wait, has that happened in the other games? I'm not sure, because I'm thinking, like, did anyone normal come into, like, Mementos or the TV world? No. No. So, huh. Wow. That, huh. Why hasn't that ever happened before? That's... Hmm. Okay. The good news is, she didn't fall victim to the shadows, even though she obviously heard their call. She should be safe from now on. But that means she'll forget Fuka saved her life, right? That doesn't seem fair. You can just drop Actually, her in an alley. I don't think it'll matter. Or a dumpster. That's fine with me. I'm sorry, Fuka. I'm so sorry. I think she's learned her lesson. And if you think I'm being way too harsh, I just have no sympathy for bullies, in all honesty. I'm sorry. You're Fuka Yamagishi, right? You're Fuka Yamagishi, right? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Relax. There's no need to be nervous. Why don't you have a seat? I mean, most people would be nervous Everyone, in your presence. You did an excellent job on covering the truth. I also wanted to let you know the three girls have all regained consciousness. What a relief. I mean, I guess, but. There's a whole reason why 
everyone's in this situation. Well, not everyone, but specifically you. From what I understand, they each came to school around midnight and waited for the security guard to leave. They were attacked by shadows near the gate as the dark hour began. Oh. However, the facts became twisted because of rumors concerning a ghost story. I knew right from the beginning that it wasn't a ghost. You had your speculations. It's all my fault. No, it's not. Are you kidding? You were the victim. But I made so many people worry. You were locked in a gym closet for 10 days. Yeah, we're worried. Hey, don't think like that. And it was because of them. We could have lost that fight if you weren't there. That's a fact. You came in clutch. You saved our lives. You should feel good about yourself. You have a special power that you can use to help others. Ooh. This is kind of like... I can kind of understand where Yukari is coming from now. Like, that, that sounds like some baiting right there. A special power? We call it Persona. You could be a tremendous help to us. Will you lend us your strength? Are you asking me to join you? Mitsuru Senpai? You know, we're not trying to pressure you, so if you need some time to think about it... I'll do it. I'll help you. Why does she look like that, bro? Like that... Are you scared? Like, <laughs> what's wrong? Oh my gosh. But admirable, though. Thank you for coming to the team. Are you sure? <laughs> If you join, you'll have to live here. Yeah, pretty terrible, right? Junpei lives here. That's fine. I'd rather live here than at home anyway. We really appreciate this. We'll have the school talk to your parents to resolve any issues. Thank you. Nice. Wait a minute. Aren't we dragging her into this a bit fast? Y'all dragged me into this even quicker. Um, it's okay, really. Now then, those special shadows showed up again. We still don't know where they're coming from, but Akihiko is right about one thing. Their appearances seem to coincide with the full moon. We'll take that into consideration from now on. So they're kind of like werewolves then, huh? It's a big advantage for us to know when to expect them. Now, on the day of the fight, we'll be ready to get in the ring. Bro, we're not... <laughs> Look at this Logan Paul looking... Oh my gosh. <sighs> oh, that's okay, Yukari. We're all in this together. Right, guys? You discovered a pattern in the appearance of the special shadows. I wonder if this is what the boy is trying to tell you. Seems that you should start paying attention to the moon's phases. I've been trying my best. Trust me. 